Here you can see Kimberly Dawn has four solar cells on the coach roof. You can see the self-tacking jib and the enclosure around the helm station. Boat is extremely clean and well kept and located in St. Augustine. The deck and coach roof lounge cushions are visible on the deck. You can see the delta anchor in the front. The aft cockpit area has an enclosure and cushions throughout. There's a high field dinghy with a Honda 20 horsepower outboard. Here at the helm you can see the chart plotter with a radar display and autopilot. The salon table converts to a berth to add additional sleeping accommodations. It's a control panel, all US wiring. This is the owner's cabin with a workstation and settee. This berth is all the way aft and it's an island berth you can walk around. The shower has a door so it's dry in the head compartment. This is the port side guest cabin looking forward and the port side guest cabin looking aft. Once again a separate shower compartment that is dry. The nav station has plenty of space for additional electronics. Here we can see a B&G VHF, fusion stereo and AC controls. In the galley, there's a three burner propane stove and microwave with a U-shaped wraparound counter area. The decks offer ample walking space. There's two sets of forward cushions for the trampoline lounge area and a delta anchor forward with an electric anchor windlass and roller furling drum for the Genoa. There's four solar cells on the coach roof on the foredeck and an enclosure around the helm station. The generator is forward in the forward deck locker, easy to access. The engines are clean. You can see there's a water maker control here. The magma barbecue grill, that's propane. The rig has ball bearing cars to make the mainsail raise easily and a radar dome. Kimberly Dawn is in St. Augustine and shows perfectly clean. It has been lightly used. The owners decided to use it as a power cat when they first purchased it and stored the sails off the boat and removed the rig. So the rigging and sails have had very little use over the last three years. And you can see in the listing the engine hours are extremely low along with the generator hours. We think Kimberly Dawn is one of the best buys in the Lagoon 420 market. The owners had the rig shortened slightly so that it is intercoastal friendly, so it will go under uh, fixed intercoastal bridges. Please contact us to make an appointment to see Kimberly Dawn before she's gone. <laughs>